Hi everybody, this is Heather from SisterWigs.com and this wig is Heidi by John Renault. It is a lace front wig, also has a little bit of perm tease here at the top and an open wefted back inside. Now this wig has a very unique wave pattern and it's also fairly new to the John Renault line and that's probably why it's a little bit more expensive than some of the other wigs that um, are of this kind of cap construction. Um, the color on Heidi is Shaded Sun, which is 27T613S8. And I'm going to go ahead and decode that for you. What that means is that you have a 27 base, 27 is strawberry blonde, um, with a 613 um, tip. So let me get a little bit more light on here so you can see. It's a very gradual progression from a strawberry blonde with a shaded root to this French Vanilla Blonde 613 tip. But as you can see, if I hold the, the one up to the other, that there has been a progression. It's just very, very subtle and very natural looking. Um, and the shaded root is in the shade eight. That's what that S8 stands for. And eight is a eh, light medium um, golden brown. So very, very pretty color. Um, I thought this would be essentially the perfect color for this wig since it has all these beautiful bohemian kind of uh, waves, the kind of waves that look like you just braided your hair and took your hair out of the braid or just spent the day at the beach. And it's got the kind of highlights that indicate that last summer you sat on a beach chair all, all day and all night and uh, just like put some lemon on the ends and like let it bleach out a little bit. It's just perfect, I think. I, I, I actually love this combination of this wig and this color. And I'm actually kind of surprised that uh, I haven't seen more reviews of this combo. It just seemed really intuitive to me. Um, but I digress. Heidi has a very beautiful lace front. Very beautiful, very natural looking. Very, very beautiful lace front there. Very nice coverage on the sides. This isn't my bio hair, this is all Heidi. My, the sides of my head are actually shaved right now. Um, so very, very pretty wig, very natural looking. I'm incredibly impressed by this wig. And it actually looks a little bit better if you take a loop ended wig brush to it and just very gently relax those waves with the brush. Very, very pretty. Ugh. Gorgeous. So here is the side. And as you can see, it's got some really pretty layers right here in the front. I'll describe those more in just a second. And here is the back. Very pretty. And here is the side. And the top. Very, very, very pretty wig. Um, I, I absolutely love this wig. And I love the fact that it's got this little bump of permatease, believe it or not. It helps give it a little bit of a, I don't know, like almost like a retro sex kitten sort of thing. I, I like it. Um, now the cap does fit a little snug. But again, that's because of all the monofilament involved. It does have a monofilament top. There you go. And lace front, as I described earlier, and open wefted back and sides. So very, very pretty. And here, actually, if I show you, it's the monofilament, even though technically it goes all the way back, actually kind of dead ends, like maybe a quarter of an inch before you get to the back of the crown because if you look really closely, that's where that permatease is. See, you can, you can see the line right there. That's where that permatease starts. So, and up close, I mean, it's a very, if you're um, permatease averse, don't worry about it. I mean, it's, even if I put the top of this wig up against the camera, it's imperceptible. It just helps give the wig a little bit of body in the back to help keep all those waves nice and bouncy and flowy. I just, I adore this color in these kinds of wigs. The shaded sun color is, is just really pretty. 
Um, it's a very subtle transitional blonde. Um, yeah, just beautiful wig. The hair quality is very nice, and it's not a particularly heavy wig. Um, the wig is, gosh, it's 4.6 ounces. The nape is 9 inches. Actually, when you have it on, it almost looks like the bottom is a uniform uh, length. And I'll show you when I put it back on. Very pretty. These front layers here, that's a 7 inch bang, so it doesn't quite go to the chin. It uh, hits me right around the lower part of my cheek. Um, very, very pretty. The front side is 10 and a half inches. The back, as I said, is 9. And from the crown to the base is 15 inches. So, something to keep in mind when you are trying to see how this wig will fit on you. Um, again, remember I have a wide face and no neck, so how things fit me might not fit you the same way. But this is just to give you a good idea of how this wig looks right out of the box. So there you go. This is my review of Heidi by John Renault in the color Shaded Sun, which is also known as 27T 613S8. I love this wig. I think that it's gorgeous. Um, but I think it's one of those that will work really well on some people and other people will be kind of left that lukewarm by it. So uh, if you suspect that you will look nice with wavy hair, this is a good one. This wave pattern is very unique and I've only ever seen it in this particular wig. Now there's a rumor that my uh, rep uh, from John Renault said that this took almost 10 years to perfect this particular wave pattern. That's neither here nor there. I don't know if that's true or not. But what I do know is that the effect overall is very, very pretty. So thank you for watching and stay tuned for more wig reviews. Uh, have a good day. Bye-bye.